Hi everybody, welcome back to another video of Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. In this episode we're going to continue on with some side quests and stuff and probably start more of the main story. So let's head on to it. Our latest newsletter is looking pick up these two side quests here and head on to the So, what's the plan once we take back our Trying to spot the autonomous <coughs> bird of Condor Hill. Apparently, it protects the island. Not sure from whom, though. Once we take back. I'm trying to spot the eponymous bird of Condor Hill. I knew to the nest. So that's a little bit around a bit. We're following head right we to the um, next side quest. So here we are right now, talking to the sky pretty soon. Pretty sure. There he is. So, here's the situation. There's this big lighthouse down by the Cape, and someone calling themselves the Merc of Junon has turned it into their hideout or something. Curie. Oh, are they an acquaintance of yours? Sorta. What are the chances? I don't know about you, but I think fate brought us together. Anyway, that place has got a killer view. We used to go up there all the time and just chill. But it's too dangerous with all the monsters around, and that merc hasn't done a thing about him. So I was hoping you could do me a solid and convince that merc to help us out. They've done many a good deed in Midgar and all throughout the grasslands. Allegedly, that is. And like, if they're so good at doing good, then why aren't they doing anything now?
The lighthouse is up ahead, right on the cape. Apparently, it used to guide ships back in the Republic days, but that was like forever ago. Anyway, it's super out of the way and crawling with monsters. Anyone who thinks customers will come calling is out of their mind. Yo, you're the best! You know, I just knew I could count on you. So, you gonna help, or...? Me? You can sniff out trouble. <laughs> I suppose that does make me the most suitable candidate. Oh, pro tip! If you ever get the chance, you ought to swing by the hill, too. You might even catch a glimpse of the Great Condor if you're lucky. If you're into that kind of stuff. Never in my wildest dreams did I think I'd end up being best buds with Avalanche. Now we got this side quest to do. We'll go to head on. Check around town to see if there's any chests or anything to pick up or anything. Also, just waste time. I don't know why. <laughs> but then we're going to do that side quest, but I think there's another side quest we can pick up from one side of the road for one. So we're going to try and do that too before we head on the story. Once we take back. I'm trying to spot the eponymous bird of Condor Hill. We finally made it to the Sega side quest of there, but let's see what they want us to do. Oh, ho! Care to join us, young lady? We've got a lovely breeze blowing today. You certainly do. So, what are you all looking at? We're on the lookout for the Great Condor. We try to catch sight of it every time it takes flight. Make sure it's in good health and all that. It's not really a danger to people, but its hunger can drive it to hunt larger prey. Let's just hope it never develops a taste for us. Surely you've seen our newsletter, haven't you? It's filled with fun facts about our beloved bird. I'm quite proud of it. Sir, I don't think the condor is going to show today. Maybe we should head back. No, let's wait a little longer, lad. That bird's got me a bit worried. Haven't seen it in a fair while now. I wonder if we should have given it something to eat after all. Perhaps. I put a post up on the notice board asking for help, but, um... Well, if you're still looking for volunteers, we'd be more than happy to help. Well, far be it for me to turn down such an offer. It's a grand old bird. Makes its nest in a small island just a stone's throw from here. Even saved my life back when I was a lad, if you can believe it. The condor was looking out for me that day, so I thought I should start looking out for it. <laughs> <laughs> 
Keep tabs on its well-being and whatnot. It's a proud creature, a hunter at heart. We've tried to feed it before, but it seems to prefer catching its own prey. If something smelled enticing enough, though, it might be moved to come and take a closer look, I suspect. Back during the war, I was running from some Shinra troopers when one of them got me in the back. I fell to the ground. I thought I was done for, until that bird snatched me up and flew me to the next town over. <laughs> I sometimes wonder if it mistook me for its supper. I never managed to regain the use of my legs, unfortunately. But I feel my spirit soar when I watch that condor fly. I may be stuck here, but at least they're still free. Thank you. I appreciate it. One of the condor's favorite hunting spots is in the woods nearby. You'll need a chocobo that can manage the climb to get there. It's pretty tough. So now we got two side quests to do. I'm gonna we'll try doing both before we go on. But I think they're gonna be pretty good ones. So I'd like to see that condor. Go and see a way to get down from here and then head on to one of these two side quests right now.
Press now before we go on to the main story. Check around this camp to see if there's anything. And I think up ahead where there's like a few things to check out. So we'll go ahead to that lighthouse mostly what we're doing.
there's a nice looking boat down there. But I think that's the boat we're supposed to go on to take a picture for that one guy that asked us for pictures. And then we got another creature here, owl. I always keep telling the owls for some kind of bird that wants to you know, draw us to the live stream. So we're going to do that now, since it's right here. Like I said, I'm going to try and finish this area up as much as I can before I move on with the story. Because I'm pretty sure we'll be back here for a very long time. I don't know when we'll be back here. It'll probably be close to the end of the game. Another one of these live streams, Crystal's done, and we're going to keep moving on to the two side quests. That's the main job, um, objective right now in the story. One well, I'm trying to do really. Then we're going to move on. Cloud, your combat data has revealed the location of the Mind Flare lurking in the Junon region. It's said this eldritch horror devours the brains of its victims. We cannot turn a blind eye to this threat. I just want to see what that creature would look like in this thing, so I've done that. I'm going to head on over to the um, mission, like I said. But we just fought them birds, so yeah. I have, I'm not going to fight that creature yet they asked me to fight. I'll probably do that later on, close in the game, like I've been saying. I have not, this is probably like the only one I'm going to do, because I don't really do that many of these. I probably do, like I said, the close end of the game, we'll do most of like, these kind of side quests and stuff. But, yep, we'll see, read the tutorial thing about it, and we're going to head on. Got that complaint, hope he likes that picture. And we're going to head on with the side quest. I'm completely missed. We're going to come down here and do this as we saw it. We're going to do that now.
place looks best if at all. I don't know how they expect it back in. I'm gonna put it best. I have no choice. They'll be thrilled to hear it. Let's go. It also looks like that girl we helped out last in the grassland is over here now and doing the same thing mostly. Let's see what trouble she got herself into this time and then we get her out of it. That's gonna be a pain in the ass. Oh, the rest spot we cut. The five spines are best here too now. That's a pretty good thing. Because we were mostly dead last fight. Check that level up, people are buying things. We're going to head on in and see what she needs. Let's do that. Here we go. Greetings. Kyrie, Merc of Juno. And you are. Oh man. I'm sure I got all excited thinking I had a customer. Well, thanks for making the trip out here to say hi, fellow Merc. Not your fellow anything. And quit calling yourself a Merc. You're giving the real ones a bad name. Uh, what even is a merc? Nobody really knows. And besides, arguably this whole mess can be laid at your feet, mister. <sighs> I came all the way out to Junon to strike it rich, but nobody knows we're here. Or even that we exist. Zero publicity, which means zero clients. I mean, this is business 101. <sighs> Since you suck so bad at self-promotion, I had to pick up the slack and come up with an ad campaign. But, like... What's your brand? Tall, blonde, and not interested? Sounds like a one-way ticket to bankruptcy to me. <laughs> Allergies. What?! Shut up! This thing can talk?! Indeed. Aren't you just the most adorable boy? Hey, you know, I've always wanted a pet of my own. Come here, come to mama! Psst, 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 psst. <laughs> uh, yikes! Okay, scratch that. Right. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm putting in all this work for us, yet we haven't managed to bring in a single customer. And if we don't get one really soon, your CEO and PR head is as good as done! But not to worry! I put my creative skills to work and came up with this ditty. Pretty good, right? Folks will be lining up in no time! Wait, monsters? Well, what could have drawn them here? I'm sure your aggressive advertising has nothing to do with it. Please, Cloud, you've gotta help me! After all, nobody knows how to take down monsters like a Merc. So hire yourself. You're a pro, aren't you? Come on, don't be petty. Oh, I'll even give you some of these! Pass. Oh, 
Wait, our lives are in as much danger as hers now. We have to fight. Don't 
stop now. I can still fight. Let's finish this! Calling fire! Turn that music off! Let's go! Let's go! Let's Come on, get rid of the line already! We got a good job! Goddamn time! Run down! Ooh! Gotta learn back! Hang back! You got to Do your thing! Monsters, headed your way. I couldn't help but worry. Uh, it looks like I worried for nothing. I should have known Avalanche could hold their own. Out of curiosity, what happened to that Merc? She moved on. Bummer. Well, guess we should get this place cleaned up. Oh yeah, Rondo was telling me you do Merc work on the side too. For real? I can't believe you didn't say anything! Best buds don't keep secrets, you know. But I hope you'll lend me a hand the next time I need help. And with that, we're going to heal up and go back um, back to the next mission, the side quest about the um, Falcon. Avalanche by day, traveling mercs by night. I don't know how you dudes find the time to do it all.
All those willing to fight against shippers tyranny are I get that we're bringing you to the CAS. There's a hosting sign. Oh, quick. Well, we're going to be used to it. These people need to get off their seats. Trying to spot the eponymous bird of Condor Hill. Apparently, it's up. What's the plan once we take back our walls? There's no way for us to get over there. I take it you're new to the nest. Our latest came pretty good. So you're an engineer now. Now that we fast travel here, we're going to continue on with another side quest about that um, giant bird, Griffin. We're going to get this cow for it to eat, so we take a picture Look, of it. Over there. We gotta sneak up very quietly on this. Oh, we scared it. I go chase it down now. There goes the condor's dinner. Maybe we can track its scent. Okay, now we gotta use the chocobos to find the cow again, so we can go feed the condor. I'm just gonna follow this path from um, chocobos, sniff down for us, and head right to it. Creatures and chase down the cow still. I got this. Finish him off. Come on. Whatever. Oh. Gotcha. We'll take out these creatures easy enough. So we'll go head on to the next. That cow. There, that right. one at all. Right. Watch and learn. Come on. That almost took that one out already. Right. Oh, right. There we go. Oh, great. Something else. Oh, it looks like somebody else was hungry. Chocobo control. We're going to we'll chase it down on Chocobo and head on to do that next time. Hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for watching. See you next time.